Tonight, this scenario will be playing out in a town near you. We got a Chinese menu in the mail today. What do you think? Go out to dinner tonight? Look what they got here. They have all kinds of great stuff. Scallops and beef, $13.95 with rice and egg rolls. What do you think? How much? $13.95 for both of us? Yeah, for both of us. Seafood Delight, $14.75. Okay, so that's $30 roughly for you and I to eat dinner. Yeah. Wouldn't you rather save that money and use it for vacation? Yeah. Yeah, All I right, guess so. so what's your choice? Um, yeah, let's see what we have in the fridge. It's dinner time. Let's open the fridge and see what we got. Well, let's see. In this case, we got a little bit of uh, cake. That'll be good for dessert. Uh, this looks like tortellini salad left over. That'll be good. Oh, that's chicken and rice. That'll be good. Oh my goodness, look at all these leftovers. There's mango in here. There's even some cheese. Hey, we have cheese and homemade bread. We can make uh, grilled cheese sandwiches. Oh yeah, that's this. Nice. This is a meal right here. This is a lot cheaper than going out. And we're cleaning out the fridge. No food waste here. This is a beautiful grilled cheese. Let's cut it on an angle. Oh, that sounds so toasty and one of my favorite foods. Whoa. Oh yeah. <laughs> Look at this feast. We have our chicken and rice with capers. We have our tortellini salad. Stay tuned for Friday's video, full tutorial. And then we just added a couple of fresh tomatoes from the garden and a half of a grilled cheese with my homemade bread and cheese that we had in our refrigerator. And here's my plate, and I don't even have to taste it and let you know that this is Paul approved. This is frugal. This is going to be delicious. Wait till you see dessert. We have a little bit of cake left, and I thought this would be such a nice accompaniment. I just have some blueberries that I have to use up, add a little bit of sugar. We're going to cook this down, make a nice blueberry sauce. Now, if I had some lemon, which I have to check the freezer and see if I do, a nice squeeze of lemon would be delicious in this. I did not add any liquid to this, and look at how beautiful they release their juices. You just want to heat them for about five minutes, and then I just took my whisk and gently broke them up. That's all there is to it. Perfect. Five minutes, look what we made. So we just have a little bit of coffee cake left over. We're finishing that up. I'm gonna put some of that blueberries right on top of it. This was just about a couple blueberries, that's all it was. I can't believe all the food that we had for dinner and we saved $30. No food waste here, everything was delicious and now I'm getting into this cake with fresh blueberry sauce. All approved.